What's up, nerdlings? What's up, nerdlings? Do you nerd for thinking about the games you wish you always had? What's up, guys? This is Jay from the Game Chasers, and you are watching Do You Nerd? This has been a fun topic going around the community. I think it came from J Love and Zap Crystal. I think that they were talking about it. Uh, correct me if I'm wrong, but I know a lot of people have done response videos about this. Essentially, it's five games you wish you had when you were a kid. <laughs> And I'm going to take a page from the book of the Trollster himself and say, Five? I can think of 55 games I wish I had as a kid. Uh, I barely had five games as a kid, so anything, anything else. <laughs> Especially when some of my games were things like Friday the 13th and Back to the Future. And I didn't need some internet nerd telling me why not to I like those gonna games. I was going to say, you just don't I like them because like Angry them Video Game Nerd merit. didn't like them. <laughs> anyway... <laughs> This is actually pretty easy, except I'm going a different route. So a lot of people have been choosing retro games that they would have liked to have had as a kid. My thing is, I kind of wanted some of the modern games. Yeah, because they were longer. They're longer now than when we were kids. That's what she said! Woo! So being able to have those longer games when we were younger would have been awesome in between those uh, rental times. <laughs> Well, first and foremost for me, I mean, I'm just gonna say Skyrim. Having that huge oh of a world and having a world that you could really sink your teeth into and kind of live within. Yeah! That would have been great. I would have spent so much time just exploring the world and doing all the little minor side quests. Look. When I had games like Super Mario World, I did everything in that game to the point that I was turning my television <laughs> upside down and beating every level on Yoshi's Island and feeling kind of weird about that, thinking, okay, I need to play another game, obviously. But Skyrim would have been great yeah. to sink all those hours into. I would have been disappointed, though, when I finally got out in the real world and realized I couldn't have a Skyrim house in the real world. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, for me, the Sims game. My favorite Sims was probably computer-wise Sims 2 because I had the most fun with that one and probably Sims 3 from the PlayStation. That one I had the most fun of and if I could have had that as a kid I would have loved it because you know even when you did have Sims on the computer it ate up all your computer space so the <laughs> fact that you could have it on a console and not take up all this update space was would have been awesome. So clearly we both wanted more out of our games. Yes. You know, speaking of more out of our games, when Robert and Wes were here and the four of us got to play some Four Swords Adventures, that would be another one. Look, yeah. that Legend of Zelda entry is basically another Link to the Past game in all of its style and animation, and I love that. Me and my buddies used to play so much Link to the Past, but the problem is it's a one-player game. Four Swords changes all of that, and I would have adored getting to play that game with <laughs> my friends. It would have been the perfect competitive co-op experience. I would also have to say Animal Crossing, but I'm talking like Animal Crossing New Horizons. The stuff that they have implemented in this game makes it so much more fun, and I would have loved to have had it way back when and with all of the modern bits if you could take the hanging out with friends and stuff yes. on the islands yes. that would have been nice yeah too. yeah all the stuff that they've implemented this time you know all the things you could do to your island the chatting the traveling all that stuff would have been so much fun back then well, for our final pick, we're totally on the same page with this one. 100%. And it's no surprise, it's basically combining my first two choices with Legend of Zelda Breath, Breath of, the, of Wild. the Wild. Again, just another huge open world to explore. But all it really comes down to is a simple fact that this is the kind of gaming experience we always wanted growing yes. up. Whenever you fall in love with a game's story, with the characters, with the world mm -hmm. itself, 
you don't want it to end. Mm -mm. And Breath of the Wild is a perfect example of a game that you can play as long as you want or pretty much as short yeah. as you want. So and if you, you're done, finish it. You if, literally could just get on there, grab a horse and just ride around. You know, there's tons of games I can remember as a child looking off in the distance and saying, I wish I could climb that mountain. Breath of the Wild, you can. <laughs> <laughs> well, I don't know if it's exactly cheating with our choices since we were thinking of a lot of the modern games, but like when we were kids, these are the kinds of games that we were always dreaming of getting to play someday. And now that we're adults, we don't have the time to play these kinds of games. <laughs> Why do you mock me, oh lord? Oh my, that's not gone. That's just a waffle that Bart tossed up there. <laughs> All right, nerdlings. Hey, this has been going around the community, as I said earlier, so feel free to leave a response video mm -hmm. if you would like to. Let We'd us know. We'd love to hear your choices. Yeah, what games would you have loved to have had as a kid? And drop some comments down below if you have anything to say about our choices. Maybe you think we're crazy going with all the new school stuff, but it would have blown our minds back then, trust me. <laughs> Give the video a like if you happen to like it. Subscribe, hit the notification bell, and... Don't forget to like us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Go over to Tee Public because we have merchandise over there. Hit us up on the Retro Refresh, and if we like it, we nerd it for modern old games. And I'm going to take a bite. <clears throat> and probably Sims 3 from the, pi from the 